Gene? We have a situation brewing with the carbon dioxide. We had a CO2 filter problem on the lunar module. Five filters on the limb. Which were meant for two guys for a day and a half. So I told the doctor. They're already up to eight on the gauges. Anything over 15 and you get impaired judgment, blackouts, the beginnings of brain asphyxia. What about the scrubbers on the command module? They take square cartridges. And the ones on the limb are round. <laughs> Tell me this isn't a government operation. It just isn't a contingency we've remotely looked at. Those CO2 levels are going to be getting toxic. Well, I suggest you gentlemen invent a way to put a square peg in a round hole. Rapidly. Okay, people, listen up. People upstairs, candidates this one, and we gotta come through. We gotta find a way to make this fit into the hole for this, using nothing but that. Let's get it organized. Okay, okay, let's build a filter. Better get some coffee going, too. CO2 gas is literally poisoning the astronauts with every breath in and out. Heads up, heads up. That's the people will not comment. Go, 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 go. Heads up, people. Look out now. What's this? That's what they got to make. Well, I hope you got the procedures for me. Right here. That's it? All right, where is this, Houston? Uh, do you have a flight plan up there? Uh, affirmative, Andy. Uh, Jack's got one right here. OK, we have a... Uh, an unusual procedure for you here. We need you to rip the cover off. I want you to rip the cover off the flight plan. It's a pleasure. All right, now the other materials you're going to need here are uh, a lithium hydroxide canister. Two, two. two lithium hydroxide canisters, I'm sorry. A uh, roll of gray tape. Duct tape. Uh, duct tape. You need an LCG bag, two LCG bags, uh, red suit hoses. You've got the flight plan covered. What about their level of carbon dioxide? It's uh, climbing. You're, you're saying that they're almost out of breathable air. No, wait a second. Wait a second. That's, that's not what he said. He said we're working. You want to cut the duct tape three feet long? I, I, Just tell me use his arm. Just use your arm. It's a good arm length. Oh, okay, Houston. I see what you're getting at. Hold on. Okay, Jack. Tear that piece of tape down the middle lengthwise. All right. Hold on, Houston. While the astronauts appear to have enough oxygen to keep them alive, one thing they have too much of is carbon dioxide. With each breath, the three men expel more of the poisonous gas into the lunar module cockpit, and the scrubbers intended to keep the atmosphere breathable are quickly becoming saturated. <coughs> oh, shit, I tore it. Shit. Uh, Houston, uh, what do we do if we, uh, rip the bag? Can we tape it? They just tore the bag. Uh, no. All right, stand by. What should I tell them to do? Well, they should have one more bag left. Close to 15. Houston, filters in place. Roger, 13. Suits are a relief to close. CO2 canister. Select to secondary. All right. There it goes. I can hear air moving. Just bring normal fellas. Aquarius, uh, please advise on CO2 status. Ah, uh, yeah, Houston, we're taking a look at those numbers right now. Uh, we're still holding close to 15, Houston. Roger that, standing by. Houston, the CO2 level has dropped to nine, and it is still falling. Yes. Good job, That is good to hear, Aquarius. 
you, sir, are a steely-eyed missile man. 